We're back with Oshinoko. Last episode, bit of a pickle. They're trying to rescript the whole play with like two and a half weeks left till go time. And Akane took Aqua on a date or is taking him on a date to a, a, a round stage. What do they want to call it? But I want to see how this plays out because it's crunch time and, you know, pressure makes diamonds. So let's see what just happens before we, go into it, before we dive in. Like always, hit the scrub button. Let's get ready. They're on Playboy. Hold up. What? Okay. It's not that Playboy. We're good. Yeah. I, yeah. You technically a, a, a entertainer now. That's bro. I don't know who the hell it is, but I'm guessing it's some it's some big actor, some very big actor. I mean, her eyes are frills. Eyes are sick still. Look, I, yep. Next feels out of the conversation because they're bringing up crazy stuff. <laughs> She's worried about getting famous, man. She wants to have big combos. Like, yeah, this pack. This A-list actor hit me up. Half it's sick. I like it. All black with a little beret. Hell yeah. Yeah, she, yeah. She came in mad. I could tell of her out of her aura, but she came in mad as hell because she he's on a date with. Oh, it's ping pong live action. Ping pong animation, live. It's the stage they're gonna be playing on. I'm, I'm guessing. Oh, they got the, they got the the early 2000s, late 90s Bulls, uh, theme going on, bro. 4DX. Oh, hella, hell yeah, bro. 4DX is sick. It's 8D audio too. Black hole. I'm going crazy. The film is also, uh, this, I mean, the the. Hold up. 360. What? This thing is so advanced. Who's that? Who's that? Who's that? Who's that? Oh, him. Uh, I forgot. He's like director, not director, producer. I forgot his title. Oh, he's getting right to your business, bro. Get, yeah, yeah, yeah. Get right to your business, man. Hold up. He's going to start making some moves. Is he going to put in some a war for a couple of things, man? Is he, better, is he better save the whole play? Hold up. Oh, you're about to get, you're about to get bitched at, brother. <laughs> yeah, he's getting the whole, all the cold soldier, sh soldier shoulder. Dad can't talk today. They uh, snacks. You, you, they can't drink, bro. Relax. She, she, auntie status, bro. Oh, you're like, they're like four, or three years too early, dog. That's a bar. If you want to hit, the, oh, that's a bar. That was a bar. We hit the general, shoot their horse first. Yeah, it's unsuitable for human, bro. Exactly. That's why so many manga artists get sick so easily and have a lot of health pains or health issues. This is literally exactly what Aqua was talking about, bro. This is literally what Aqua was talking about. It. Damn, that's okay. Why are you, why are you gonna say it like that, girl? Jesus. <laughs> this happened to her, and then her whole career got turned upside down. Dang. Dang. Yo, she's going for the jugular right now. Holy crap. Yeah, she got, she's in her head crazy. 10 million copies? Get, oh my gosh. No wonder she got an anime crazy. Those are crazy numbers, bro. Damn, looks like that mission was a fail, bro. Ah, they went their way and it didn't work out, but oh well. Come on, Aqua, pull some strings, bro. Pull some strings, Aqua, dog. You gotta make this reasonable, bro. Is that a battery? What is that? What is that? Brown envelope, bro. 
I know that apartment's trashed. I just feel like there's so much like cup. Oh, wait, never seen her up. Oh, I wasn't wrong about that. So she, uh, yeah, I understand, bro. She's, yeah, dog. Yeah, bro. She's two sleep two hours a day, bro. That's not enough. She's scared. She's scared to just delegate stuff when she knows she's more capable, more than capable herself. Yeah, bro. She's falling so behind, dog. She needs help, bro. That's why she's there. Oh, she's putting her hair up. Oh, hold on. it's getting crazy. Is that Lloyd? It's like old times. Come on, Nabiko, bro. You gotta put more trust in others, dog. Oh. Oh. Dang. That she just says something she can't take back right now. Oh. Oh, wow. Oh, now they're gonna be. Oh wow! They're they're going back they're going back and forth, man. They're going back and forth. This is this is this is a, a dick mission contest at this point, man. I thought how it was when they were working together in the, in the past. At least she can take it, dog. She can take it, dog. Yo, they're they're going back. She's throwing slug. She's throwing haymakers back. Oh, they're going at it. They're, they're throwing slugs. They're throwing haymakers. Are those all bills, bro? You better, you better get hit for tax evasion. Well, at least it looks like, it looks like they're making headway, bro. Oh, they probably winning it all night, huh? Yep. It, damn, bro, that room is full of garbage bags. Thanks, like when two fighters go at it to the point where they're like just super drained, and then a stalemate, both missing one arm. So I'm saying, if anyone did that, they would have cut ties up there, bro. But she was able to take it, and she threw some. See, she threw some back, bro. Damn, bro. She had passion for the game, bro. She loved that. that. She was like, no other. Dang, bro. The, the series had like a, a one star rating. But that's the part where Aqua came in and it wasn't like the best rated episode, too. Look at her eyes. They just changed. Oh, that's what it was. He gave her a ticket. She had the same mindset as Aqua before. And now, this is how they end the episode now? With her going to the show? Hilarious. That was, um, that was an intense episode, man. They, those girls were just in a crazy cat fight. They were going for each other's jugular, not holding back. Dude, they were saying, yelling some mean stuff, some hurtful stuff at each other. But in the end, they, they hashed it out, you know? They they fought with their words, got everything off their chest, if you want to call it that. Well, not even that. She, yeah. One was arrogant, so I get put in her place. But Akiba was just getting too, 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 too big-headed, too inflated with her ego. And she had, she needed that person to just smack some sense in her, talk some sense in her. And hopefully that kind of was the catalyst for her to just collaborate or be more collaborative with the script. So things can just get smoothed out, and hopefully, the drama or the two, the what was it called, the the four D play, you know, the two point five D play, still be at a high caliber, you know. And this was happening all because of Aqua. Aqua, my man, is pulling strings. He is clawing at this dude. He wants this to be successful because this also like this is big for him. You know, one of his big acting breaks and. Depending how it goes, they can thrust him into stardom. He has more access to, 
utilities and tools like, like of other people and can make better connections and learn more about his mom. So what he did hopefully pushed everything into the right path. So I'm excited to see Akibo's perspective after she watches that play because it changes people. Akko wasn't riding with it, but now he's he understands his viewpoint changed. So hopefully the same cap at Akibo and everything gets smoothed out and then we can keep continuing with this this arc. But for now, that is all I got. So like always, hit the subscribe button, like comment, all that good stuff, man. And I'll catch y'all in the next one.